Hello Aquarius, hope you're all having a wonderful day. This is your horoscope for the month of May. And I've got my little pal here who's just chilling out with me. It's my kitty Willow. So, let me just get, there we go. So your horoscope this month, Aquarius. In regards to career path, I feel like that you're questioning your creative flow. You might feel a little blocked or a little out of alignment or out of sorts. And I think it's really important for you to go sit in the sunshine, get your feet on the ground, um, play in the dirt. If you're like a garden, that would really help. Grounding is very important for you this month because I feel like honestly that you've got such a light energy that it's almost like you have to... Mm, you've got to be able to stay grounded, but also have that floaty energy that you're so prone to. Now, I feel like that with work, um, you may feel like you're not really tied to the project you're working on or the aspect that you're on, or if you're going to school you're bored, you're kind of over it, and you want something new, um, or you kind of feel like you're not being appreciated. Uh, if you have Aries in your chart in some way, it's very, very similar. Um, but I do feel like that you're going to find that flow around mid to late May, and especially if you're artistic and creative, um, you're going to have a huge burst of ideas. If you're a business owner, I really feel like that something about digital marketing or um, platform marketing is a good idea for you this month. It may give you a boost. Um, romantically speaking, Aquarius, if you are in a relationship, it's almost as if you feel like your hands are tied. There's something that's going on in your relationship that you're pretty happy with things, but you almost feel like that you have to be the one that gives concessions in each situation, and you're about done with that. And so some of you may be ending relationships, but you already know that you're headed in that direction. It's not going to be a shock or surprise. Um, I also keep feeling like there's something about secrets on a phone or somebody not being honest, and I also feel like that if you're in a relationship, if you're married, it's almost as if like hiding financial information or someone is having an issue with taking care of the finances. So be really, really mindful because that could really bite you at the end of the month. So if you're single, I do see potential for um, relationships coming up for you around the middle of the month. If you're male or if you identify as masculine, I feel like you're going to have a bit of a better shot because there's something about, even though Mercury's going to be going into retrograde, there's something about this brightness around you. Ladies, yours is more towards the end of the month when retrograde is over and you feel more safe to reach out and connect with those that you're interested in. And if you are... Uh, if you do not identify those pronouns, I do believe that it's a safe month for you to date, but I feel like that it's almost as if there's some reservations about safety and security. Okay, so health-wise, I do feel like Aquarius, that there's something about the vision, uh, your eyes, or um, something about blurriness. It could be that if you wear contacts, you might need to get a different prescription, or if you've just recently got uh, glasses or contacts, you might be getting adjusted, getting used to your prescription or your, um, you know, or getting older, that kind of thing sometimes. Um, there's also something about the lower back and the left arm, I'm like above the elbow, uh, like towards your shoulder. I don't know if you're, pull, if you're lifting a lot of heavy things, like you're moving or something, but it just, it feels like you're carrying a lot of heavy weight. And the ankles are also, um, the feet, but mostly the ankles are standing out as well. And all in all, things look good for you, Aquarius. Financially, I think that you are, you're trying to stay within your means. You're trying to stay structured. 
you're trying to stay in a good place. However, you might be feeling like you need to buy something awesome or shiny because you're feeling a little depressed about the, hey, what are you doing, ma'am? About the, um, the aspect of your current situation. I feel like there might be a lot of moves happening to this, this month. So if y'all are moving, then you might want to, um, plan, plan for that definitely. And then in general, I keep hearing, don't do anything with your hair this month unless you already planned it. And, um, uh, if you're just spur of the moment wanting to, to do that, just know that, uh, it, it may not turn out the way you'd like, but, um, I think that it's mostly like color cuts. Okay. But like, if you're going to go a different color or lighter or darker, you might think about that twice. You know what I mean? So that's all I've got for you, Aquarius. Thanks for watching. Bye.